hello hi welcome back to the channel guys Tawa and his wife started conducting our pair interviews the first candidate shared the amazing background and experience she had they were happy about her experience and considered giving her the job but before everything they had to find out how much she was expecting to be paid and they were so shocked after they realized that she wanted 25,000 rand and that's out of Tawa and Mabiti Street after conducting several interviews, they saw it's not their cup of tea. Since the cheapest candidate required 15,000 rand and they don't have that kind of money, so Tawa and Mapiti decided to settle for a nanny instead of an OP. On Sir Camilla's family, you see that Elizabeth and her husband are having some nice chilled conversation about Guido's food, and she noticed that Guido made 80,000 rand out of his old books so they paid 80,000 rand but she got upset when their conversation escalated to quite a mentioning that he wants to focus on writing more and he doesn't even love the job that he's currently doing so he wants to go back to writing so that he can generate more money and that made Lizzie so upset Jovia's case has been breaking for so long guys we finally see that they are preparing for a trial. We see Tobias very scared and her mom very scared, guys. They were not knowing what the outcome might be. So they had to prepare before they leave. they saying goodbyes. And when they were on court, what happened to Tobias was heartbreaking. The judge didn't even waste time and found Tobias guilty. Tobias was sentenced 15 years in prison and started serving immediately. Evelyn broke in tears. She was crying, crawling down, guys, like a parent that she is. She was so shattered, and the Maputas were busy celebrating the victory. This is so heartbreaking. So after the court trial, Anjaki had to go home. People were dragging her left, right, and center, guys. They were pouring her with some ugly stories, ugly names. They were calling her all sorts of ugly names. So we see that this storyline has come to an end, guys. We see that Tobias future has shattered because of one lazy night. And this storyline is teaching us a lot. Please, boys and girls, women and men, please take care of yourself. And if someone doesn't want to sleep with you, just rub it and don't do anything stupid that will lead you to taking your life away from you. Because now 15 years is part of Tobias' life. What will she do after coming out of jail?